and we are hello. And we are hello. That's I don't right. think so, baby. <laughs> I'm Cindy. And I'm Ant. And we're from Founders, Founders Connect. Connect. And uh, we are here in Commune um, Resort. Yes, in Bali. Yep. And I am just sharing this yet. So you can, we're going to do it. So here, let's go. So we're going to share that. Oh no, it's terrible. Yes, okay. it's so terrible today yep. because we had a massive five day WDS with Roger Ham. What does that mean, WDS? It's oh. not WDS, it's WDM. Oh, sorry, WDM. <laughs> well, I don't know why I put it. So. Because you're thinking about a summit, but it's not a summit. It's oh, Wealth, Dynamic, Wealth Dynamic Masters, which is a five day mastermind program for yes. entrepreneurs. Here, well, not here in Commune, but we had it at Vision uh, Villas, Vision Villas yes. which is about 10 minutes by bus from here. Yes. And uh, so we wanted to share our key takeaways, three key takeaways from the week of um, coming into the event and I guess what we learned and what we uh, leave with. Um, exactly. There's actually a lot of things we leave with. But what for you, just one thing that, that you. Oh, when you came into the event, what were you expecting, if anything? Actually, I wasn't expecting anything. Um, well, maybe I have to rephrase that now. I think from what we were told, we were expect in, expecting a plan after the end of the process. And so... Do you feel we have that? We have a, uh, I could say, a more like an upper-level plan not really like a plan plan that um, uh, I kind of like would like but yeah so what do you need to do then so now at the moment we need to do the hui and the what's the other side of it hui and the what the, what, the, the how yeah hui and the howie but then that's the who you bring the how so well that's why I'm here the howie that's what we need to do, isn't it? Yep. Yep. So, yep. Okay, cool. Well, so, what did you learn, my lovey? Lovey, lovey, well, lovey, lovey? I think there's um, the biggest takeaway for me was if you want to grow your business, um, then you need to actually create from the space of you already at that level you're trying to reach. And if you do not do that, what happens is you just keep going around in circles because you only create from what you know and what you know is limited, right? So whatever results you have right now or have been able to create in the past few years um, is because of a certain level of consciousness, of mindset, of whatever you of have. Of thinking. Yeah, of thinking that you have. So the, the real benefit of being in a room with people who have, like we were in rooms with people who have million dollar companies and people who, um, one guy in Taiwan, he basically does numerology and he's like had 2,000 plus customers, like yeah. 12 franchises in Taiwan. Like this guy was just uh, incredible. Yeah. Um, and like you wouldn't know it, like just by sitting next, next, to, to, next to the person, like you wouldn't know, yeah, so, right? So I think what my takeaway is just basically connect with people wholeheartedly, you know. Uh, don't seek out any expectations and You'd be surprised how much they are able to help you and guide you. And you have to ask for that, though. Of course, and, and, but I mean, the thing is, it's all about authentic, right? Yeah. How authentic you are and how passionate you are about your own um, goals and ideas. Your purpose. You, yeah, and your purpose. And if you want to stand for it or not, right? And if you stand for it, no one can push you down, basically. Yeah. And a big one for you, maybe, is that you have to share your purpose and your dream. Yes, I have that in my new, new what, numerology uh, yes. reading. Taiwanese guy, Michael. Michael. Thank you for that reading. Yes. And now I know how to take advantage of that. Yeah. <laughs> because the second you start sharing your big vision and not holding it in for yourself, is some people then say, oh, well, yeah, I know someone who can help you with that or I can help you with that or... Like we met this amazing woman by the name of Claire from New Zealand, mm -hmm. uh, and she's been building sustainable. Uh, 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 what does she call them? She calls them circular systems um, for like 30 years. So she has definitely the knowledge on how to do it, and she's been 
code from different countries to go and actually help them do it. Uh, and this is something that, you know, very much related to what Cindy's dream has been for yes, a long time. Yes. Uh, is okay, well, how do you do that? And here's someone that can actually go and do it. And she's like, I'll just do it for you, right? You just give me the plan when and, and work out where it's gonna happen, right? So that's a huge thing, right? Yeah. Um, and that's tied to, uh, yeah, when you are clear on, is when you're very clear on what your why is, and you have to t connect that to, a, we did a process for our, um, um, our vision, our life vision, and and your and that's more around like just designing what your ideal year would look like, um, and then you tie that. So the plan and the vision are connected. So if you have the vision first, and you map that out, and then you connect your plan to that, the vision drives the plan, but then the plan creates the vision. So it's it, that's how it works. You know, and so I see a lot of, and I've done this, where you just sit down and you work on a marketing plan or a business plan, but it has no connection to your, the life you want, um, or has a limited connection to it. And then, you know, that's something that we worked on together. It's like, well, you know, Cindy still has to complete her personal vision. That's still something. Um, true, true, it? but, you know, personal vision um, is really something that speaks to your heart and mind. So you don't cut. I can't force it, mm -hmm. and I don't think you should force it. So, when it comes, you will totally cut right to your arms drop into your finish, basically. And so, yeah, 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 and 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 you have to start create, somewhere. You have to create the space for that. So yeah. you make a time. Okay, I will commit like this date or this time, this time to go and do that. Sit in, in your space, whether it's nature or whatever it is, and just yeah. like because if you don't create the time for it, it won't happen. Um, and the other thing is something that I think not all of us took away from that experience was you have to be very specific what you're asking for from the universe because specific yeah. when where who where who, like all where? the details like if you can say if you're gonna say I'm gonna make a million dollars next year okay when are you gonna make the first 250 grand right what are you selling to make that, that money you know who are you selling it to Who's in your team? Who's your partners? So all these things are very important uh, because mm. with, with clarity and focus comes those opportunities, all right? And so that that was um, really big a for me too one. because I used to think I, I've got detail, but then I see here, no, I'm actually missing detail. Like um, specifically, even partners. Who are your partners? When you say partners, global partners, okay, but what does that mean, right? Um, yeah, it has to be more of a specific, like social global partners. Yeah. Right. And then we also learned a little bit about, um, which is probably, I don't know how many takeaways we've talked about already, but the, the <laughs> quite a lot. So, yeah. Yeah. Hi. Um, we're good. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. And just uh, about pitching as well, about when you have a vision, you need to map it out. Like we have a, like a nine, we were taken through a nine slide deck we had to create, and we had literally one day to create it. Um, well, was it one day honestly, even? Honestly, we had I don't think even well, one well, day. Honestly, I already knew that was coming, so we actually had the five days to create it. So I had yeah, worked on some already. But then we had very limited it to pitch it yeah, to the half team. Yeah, an hour. And half. Yeah. Um, and so, and that's all about preparation, right? Like opportunities will come to you and you may not always be prepared. Well, if you don't prepare for it, then you get stuck because you're like, oh, you know, but yeah. you never know. You yeah. could be... I, you could be at a you know out here at a resort somewhere, or you could be in the airport and you're sitting next to like Richard Branson or someone like that. And Roger shared a story of how he went and he was on a plane with Nelson Mandela, um, and he took that opportunity, took the moment to go and actually build a relationship with Nelson Mandela, you know, with other people just sitting there and they were in business class and Nelson Mandela was in, in first class, but people were just sitting and watching, hoping that they were what the person that what Roger was being, yeah, right, and. And I've been seeing myself in those moments where it's like, I wish I could be like that person. And the thing is, you can, right? It's just, you have to, you're feeling that fear or the butterflies or whatever, and you have to just breathe through it. And um, But he also you mentioned know. that the thing is that people stop themselves from doing it. Of course. That yeah. They don't have a, 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 what do you call it, a life dream. Um, Kind of uh, what's it called? What did you put it? Put it two words. I can't remember. Life dream. Because 
well, what he shared, what, what he shared was what made him go do that when he could have frozen was that he he thought about what's the story, life story oh, that, that he could tell. All right, from that experience, he didn't want to just tell people, "Hey, I was on a plane in Nelson Mandela," because that's like, okay, that's cool, so what, right? Mm -hmm. But the story he wanted to share was, I was, I had a conversation with Nelson Mandela, and he's, this is what he, how he's, like, he's connected to his pers purpose about helping entrepreneurs. This is what Nelson Mandela shared about helping entrepreneurs. So that, so when you are in those moments, you need to, like, consider what's the story that you really want. To share here about your life and and the type of person that you are you know are you the person that's going to sit back and watch the other person take the action or are you going to be the one who be like i felt the fear or the assignment and i went for it anyway um and i did the thing right mm -hmm. for a lot of us we hold ourselves back it's like oh i don't have the speech prepared i don't have the the business plan ready i don't have the right mentors there's all these i don't haves right but instead you focus on well what i'm trying to create is this and you just lead with that then you know and i will create this right it's the certainty when you speak with certainty that's very magnetic and people who don't have certainty follow people with certainty right because they want that you know they want that energy they want that that's the leader i want to go with it with a strong leader well it's true though that's yeah. true you don't want uncertain leaders you can't people don't follow uncertainty anyway yeah. so that's about for us isn't it but that's it we have to head off. We're gonna go jump on a, a ride now to Changu. First time we've been to Changu, yes. and uh, we're gonna be there for a few days. And we're working on our summit. So uh, if you haven't checked out the Remote Business Summit, just head over to www.remotebusinesssummit.com. Twenty-five speakers talking about how to grow a remote business and a remote team successfully. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's happening next month. It's, it's uh, less than a month away now. Oh. So go grab your free ticket. And if you have any questions about what we just shared. Uh, any thoughts or experiences, let us know. Uh, anything about the summer as well. We're here to help you. All right. Okay. Cool. Ciao. Ciao. ciao.